we are back. Back to try the new. What are we trying, man? The uh, Texan. The, the Texan fried chicken and the Texan grilled chicken. Is that right? That's right, man. That's right. So we're at Hungry Jacks now. We're actually in the drive through. So, guys, we'll be back and let you know what we think right after this. <laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome back to Hunky Food Dudes, another episode, episode 71. I'm with the man himself, KP. How you going, KP? I'm good, man. How are you? Good, man. What are we, what are we doing today, man? What well, are we doing? Myself, KP, and the big man, Chris C, are doing the Texan Jack's fried chicken and the Texan Jack's grilled chicken. So two go. separate burgers. So there's a fried chicken version and a grilled chicken burger. Well, you did the bacon. I did the bacon Texan deluxe. Bacon Texan one. bacon deluxe. Yep. And you liked that one. I did. I liked that peppercorn sauce. You know, if you can see behind us that they've got it on the bottom here. See there, if I go like that, the peppercorn sauce actually liked that sauce. Yeah. So, so they, he liked it. Sure. You're going to like this one too. Well, we did like the other chicken thing they did. So. Yeah. All right, so the first one we're going to try is the Texan Jack's Texan. Fried Chicken. Tell us what's in it, man. Well, it's got the big, thick, crispy and juicy fried chicken fillet topped with peppercorn sauce, premium eye bacon, melted cheese, smoky barbecue sauce, and lettuce on a toasted brioche bun. And what's the other one we're doing, man? So the other one here, if you go back, we'll bring back that menu, is the Texan Grilled Chicken. So everyone can see that behind us. That's... Flame grilled Aussie chicken breast fillet topped with peppercorn sauce, premium eye bacon, melted cheese, smoky barbecue sauce, lettuce, and tomato on a toasted sesame bun. So the difference is flame grilled chicken and a traditional toasted sesame bun instead of a brioche. There you go, guys. This is an important announcement. Hey. Sorry to interrupt this awesome food review. Unfortunately, when we were making the thumbnail in between the video, the microphone was moved and we accidentally hit the mute button. So guys, really sorry about that. So the next part of the video, when we eat, it's just gonna be fast forwarded and then we'll give our review at the end. So sorry to all the HFD fam out there. We did stuff up, it was my fault, my fault, but it is what it is. Guys, stay hunky, enjoy the rest of the show. We just finished them. We had the Texan Jack's fried chicken. You, now, you got your information. Now, the Texan Jack fried chicken, guys, $12.55 calories, $7.85 calories for that one. And medium meal will set you back $16.95 and $12.71 calories, guys. So it's, a bit, it's Hungry Jack's is pricey, isn't it's it? It's a bit pricey there, guys. A bit pricey. KP, what do you think of that one, man? Well, I liked it. Like you said to me, I had to have a choice between the two. I'd pick the fried chicken. We've said it, me and you, to be fair, we've said it consistently since probably two, three years ago when it first came out that we liked their chicken. And I know we copped it a bit about it, but we've always said that their chicken's nice. I like the peppercorn sauce. And I think you were saying too, when we're eating peppercorn it, it's got that nice. little flavor to it. I'd get that one again because of our little mistake that we made that oh. if you know, you know, yeah. I can bring it down a bit. Because of the price, because I didn't think about that before. It is pricey. It is very and pricey. And I think Hungry well, Jack's Burgers, they gotta, they got to notch them down. Like, listen, even Macca's is still a bit pricey at the moment, but it's cheaper than Hungry Jack's. So I reckon it's nice, though. For going just on flavor, I reckon 6.8 potatoes. If you're taking in the price, everything. Yeah. Yeah. You know, 12.50 for a burger is a bit. It is. What 12, about you, 12.55. Well, look, Texan Jack's Fried Chicken, look, I, I did like it a lot. Yeah, I liked it. I liked it a lot. As you said, the price twelve dollars fifty five for yeah. just by itself. You know, you, you might as well get the meal at sixteen ninety five. Yeah, at least seventeen 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 dollars for a meal, and that's a medium meal, by the way. That, that's not going to fill me up. Yeah, we don't get medium meals. No, so it's you know for the price, I disagree. I don't think it's. I, I disagree with the price. I just don't think that it's it's worth that price. Hungry Jacks. I think you got to look at your prices. Yeah, definitely. However, flavor wise, I think it's, it's, it's a great burger. The combination with the, the bacon, the barbecue sauce, and then the pepper sauce makes yeah. it really enjoyable to eat. Uh, I love that peppery taste. The peppercorn sauce get. is nice, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I love yeah. it. I love it. So yeah, it gives you a bit of that, that heat in your mouth. Yeah, um, when just you eat a touch. It. It's not just bad. Touch. It's just, yeah. not like chili or anything, but yeah. like, yeah, it's really nice. Yeah. Look, I'm going to go, yeah, 6.5 potatoes for that one. Yeah. Yeah, flavor, I was just say, flavor good. It's just the price that lets it down, guys. It's just so expensive. If they're going to make it that price, like, make it bigger. 
Yeah, hundred percent. Make it like a whopper size or something. Yeah, the whopper. Yeah, then then it'll be justifiable. But it's yeah for that for the for the size, it's not worth the money. No, agreed. Agreed. Yeah, but up to you guys if you want to try it. I think you still got to try it, even yeah. though it's just to try it. Just you got to try it. It's it's nice. But yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. Now the next one we did try was the Texan grilled chicken. That was eleven dollars and five cents. So still a bit pricey for a grilled chicken. Four hundred and twenty-three calories. So the calories were a bit low on this one, obviously because it's grilled. Did taste like it was a more healthier option when we were eating it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were smashing it. Like, yeah. if you did a challenge of that, it wouldn't be like your challenge the other day. Nah. You'd be like, oh, of course You not. were like down 12 of them <laughs> yeah. before it touched the size. Of course. Like, and medium meal will set you back $15.45 and 909 calories for a medium meal, roughly. So, look, for this one, I'm going to go. I like that they had the tomato in it. I like the fresh tomato. I think tomato. the tomato yeah. saved it. Yeah, agreed. Because I think without the tomato, it would have been a bit bland, yeah. to tell you the truth. So I'm going to go just a, a notch down. So 5.5 potatoes. As I said, if the flavors are there, would I buy that one though? I wouldn't buy If I was going to buy any of them, it would be the fried chicken one. Yeah. But yeah, it's, it's still a good burger. If you like the grilled chicken burger, then yeah, give it a try. But as I said, $11.05 for a small... It's Burger, not, it's it's not worth it. Yeah, I agree. You know what I mean? So. I agree. Well, listen, I'm going to touch on everything Chris said I think is right. The tomato saved it, but the peppercorn sauce is nice. The barbecue is nice. The bacon's nice. Ever since Hungry Jack's changed their bacon, it's been better. You know, back in the day, their bacon wasn't as good. It's been a lot better now. But again... Hungry Jacks, look at your prices. It's mm. when when you think about it, you can buy a kilo of chicken for ten bucks mm. and grill it. You can. You know, and there's eleven bucks for this burger. 11 so bucks, twenty-four. Yeah, I'm gonna say exactly the same as Chris, man. Five point five potatoes. Five point five. Yeah, but you know, it was nice. I yeah, didn't mind it, man. I, as I said, go try it out if you like the chicken variety. If you like chicken burgers, go try it out. Yeah. Remember when you do go there, make sure you've uh, got a bit in your wallet because yeah. you know, if you take a family there, you take Oof. yeah, it's gonna Oof. it's gonna eat into your funds pretty quickly oh, yeah. so but yeah guys well episode 71 done 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 and done dusted we'll be back for more hopefully before the new year if not well, we, we uh i believe we got a request from the uh, great man about a was it a red velvet lava cake from yeah, Domino's so, from the great man zakal zakal so uh, and I, I sneakily googled what it looks like and listen <laughs> i love red velvet that's right and I Googled it just to look it up. I'm like, oh, that looks all right. So it yeah, might be a dessert right. one coming up. Yeah, so <laughs> Domino's are doing that. So yeah. we might do that one. If you guys got something that you want us to try, let us know. Let us know in the comments below, guys, because uh, we'll try anything really. 100%. So let us know. But yeah, guys, well, thanks for watching. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. Don't forget to check out all of our social media platforms in the description below. That's Facebook, Instagram, X, you, you name, name it. it. I love X now. So I feel like an X man. <laughs> <laughs> I get to go like this. <laughs> and guys, we'll see you in the next episode of Hunky Food Dudes. And remember, stay I'm gonna hunky. Stay hunky. Bye, <laughs> <laughs> <Stay>, guys. <laughs>